Hey, this is James from CodeWP, and in this video, I'm going to be taking a look at our new Oxygen Builder Advanced Query AI Generation Mode. And this is available to everybody. Uh, the free plans, this is available for a limited time, and this will always be available to the pro plans. Um, just a quick note, if you don't use Oxygen, this isn't really the video for you. But luckily, we have a whole bunch of other modes, as well as the WordPress PHP General Mode, which is free for everybody and generally good at everything. So let's take a look at what this new mode is. And I think if you use Oxygen Builder a lot, you're really going to like this. And it's a really interesting showcase of what artificial intelligence can do in 2023. So in Oxygen Builder, we have easy posts and repeaters. Easy posts and repeaters use the standard WordPress query feature where we can query a bunch of different uh, pieces of content, custom post types, and then filter it down by, say, a date range or a uh, custom taxonomy or something along the lines of that. Um, those repeaters can, can kind of use a really basic graphical user interface, but they can also use the Advanced Query Builder. So this is the Advanced Query Builder in Oxygen Builder. It's found under your repeaters and easy posts, and it looks a little bit like this. You can see that if you're familiar with how WordPress querying works, it's essentially giving you a GUI of, uh, of, of a really easy interface to set queries based on the standard WordPress functions. With that being said, we can also go ahead now and add dynamic data, which is really interesting because it gets us to being able to kind of dynamically create queries um, when previously in Oxygen we couldn't do that. There are two drawbacks here, which we mentioned in this little write-up. Number one, many people don't know how to actually create the query that they want because it's complicated to be, begin with, and if you're not familiar with the code, it's not really the easiest thing in the world. Number two, if you have the query and it's really long, it can get really tedious to add this button and then click this button and click this button and click this button. And the reason this mode was born was because our agency, Isotropic, um, the agency behind the product of CodeWP also builds websites on a professional level using Oxygen. And it can get really tedious creating many different advanced queries. Um, so we created this mode. And what this mode does is you enter a single prompt. Say, for example, retrieve all posts by a current user. They must have a current a custom field um, value of one for featured and are in a date range from XYZ. And that, if we were to create a standard WordPress query from that, it would pass in a bunch of arguments saying we want a post type of post, we want the custom field uh, featured, the meta value and the key to be one and featured. Um, we want all of this information and then we'll create the query from it and we'll return a whole bunch of post objects which then can be used in our custom coded theme. In Oxygen, we can do this in the repeater and it will return a bunch of different repeater cells which you can then place titles and so on and so forth into it. And this prompt that we put into our generator will result in code that looks like this. And this code is actually the JSON code that makes up Oxygen Builder elements. We can then copy and paste this just into a uh, reusable part in Oxygen Builder and we'll be off to the races. So I think it's probably better that I show and don't tell. Um, so I've signed up with a demo account on codewp.ai. This is the free plan. Uh, once you sign up, you'll end up here. I recommend watching the onboarding video just to get an understanding of how the platform actually works. But if you really just want to try out this cool mode, um, you go exactly like this. First, you can click here or do Command M. You'll get into the modes section. Um, something to note is that if you're on the free plan, everything's locked other than WordPress PHP, but also you have access to the advanced query generator for the time being. Um, click it to switch into it. You'll see that now it's Oxygen JSON. Um, and I'm gonna just create a new prompt. And I'm gonna say, uh, I'm just gonna copy the prompt that was in that, that example. And I'm gonna generate the code. Um, and what this does is, number one, it takes your language and it understands it. And it says, what is this user actually trying to get from their WordPress website? 
and it looks through and it says, oh, we want to retrieve posts. We want to retrieve posts by the current user. We want to retrieve um, posts with this different tag associated with it. And it creates the WordPress query code um, first. And then from that WordPress query code, it will convert it into the JSON format um, of an Oxygen Builder repeater. And this is that right here. So I'm going to just take this and install it into my website. This is an Oxygen Builder trial uh, website. And I'm going to hop into uh, templates. And then from templates, add a new reusable part. And then from that, I'm going to click on JSON here. And then insert it like so. Um, and then I'm going to just give it a name of one and publish it. So now when I go to create a new page in Oxygen, I'm going to have that reusable part that I can kind of insert into whatever page I want. And I think typically when we build Oxygen Builder websites and use these type of um, setups, we're going to insert the reusable part doing it as a single, which means you can only edit it from your back end uh, reusable part editor, but I'm going to in enter it as editable just so you can see what it is. So this is just directly imported from that copy paste. You can see that these are the labels here. And if I go into query, edit query, we can see that uh, it essentially built out exactly what I wanted. And it's important to note, this isn't always going to be right. It uses artificial intelligence. AI is not always right. But in many cases, this will be right, which is really interesting and really fun uh, once you start kind of using this in your day to day workflow. Um, advanced queries in Oxygen Builder are incredibly powerful. Uh, now this new AI mode allows you to really make the most out of this feature, even if um, you don't really understand how the WP query system works um, and kind of have an idea of what you want in English or your native language because we support 11 languages on CodeWP and can write it out, but you can't really code it and you can't really convert it to this. This will do exactly that and kind of create really complex, um, but also easily understandable advanced queries that can be inserted directly into Oxygen. So again, we uh, just go into create, we create a new prompt. Um, from that prompt, we'll take this JSON, create a new reusable part, go down here, paste it in word for word, publish it, and then we can use it wherever. We can also go in here and kind of review what had been created before. All right, I hope this video is helpful on showing you how to use that new mode. And uh, until the next video, I'll see you.